I hear about this place all the time on TikTok and now that I'm in LA, I finally get to try it. So this is a very popular fast food restaurant called Raising Cane's and everybody obsesses over the chicken finger. So I'm going to see if it actually lives up to the hype. So I got this, which is called the three finger combo and you can buy their sauce in cups and that's not even a lot. The chicken is very crispy and tender and the sauce makes it even better. I would describe the sauce as a peppery mayonnaise ranch tangy sort of vibe. And now it's time for the bread. And of course, I'm having it with the sauce too. And it is so good. Crispy on the outside and very soft on the inside i just wish it tasted a bit more buttery but other than that it's really good and now time for the fries and you are joking if you only eat one fry at a time this is the proper way to eat it and this is also angelo approved the fries are so crispy and i just love crinkle cut fries and look as i'm eating chicken the sauce spills on my pants i always spill sauce on my pants and lastly we have the lemonade which is so refreshing very sweet zesty and lemony 10 out of 10 so if you're a chicken finger enthusiast go definitely check this out it's called raising canes who didn't flush the toilet? Are you accusing me right now? I go to the bathroom and then I noticed the toilet wasn't flushed. It wasn't me, I flushed the toilet. Well, there's only two people in the house. Who else would it be? It could have been the driver. We have 16 workers around the house and she's blaming it on me. I am asking you a simple question. Did you or did you not flush the toilet? You know what, this is ridiculous. She is so ungrateful. I prepared dinner, she just spits it out. I asked for filtered water, not tap water. Stop trying to change the topic. I know you didn't flush the toilet. What do you mean changing the topic? You asked me a question, I can answer it, now you're giving me this. You are so fucking rude. You know what, I'm done. I'm the one leaving now. This is your house, where are you going? Whatever, I'm done, I'm out of here. Did you want to come to the beach with me today? Um, I already went. I am so shocked right now. She told me she already went to the beach. Why? Did you want to go? I thought we'd do things together. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, please. You cannot even swim. She starts overreacting. The bitch can't even swim. You are so rude. Do you want to know why I can't swim? Why? Because I broke my leg. She's now claiming she broke her leg when it's perfectly fine. You're not the only one in pain. What do you mean? Because I'm pregnant. Excuse me? Am I hearing this right? What do you mean you're pregnant? Like there's a human in my stomach. I still can't believe you kept this a secret. Because you're always going around telling other people my secret. It's not professional and it's not ethical. You know what? Get out of my face. Okay, fine. I'm done. I'm yeah, you know what? I'm glad you're leaving. Go away and never come back. What are you wearing for your birthday? What do you mean? Her birthday party is in two days and she hasn't decided what she's gonna wear. I thought we didn't have any plans for my birthday. Yeah. 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 Was this supposed to be a surprise party? It was supposed to be a surprise party. I can't believe this. You spoiled my birthday surprise. Why are you crying? Because you ruined my surprise. Are you using a beauty blender to wipe your tears? Something that was supposed to be my special day got ruined. You're always ruining my surprises. You said you didn't like surprises. Yeah, it was not for my birthday. You don't thank me enough. There we go again, making everything about yourself it's not professional and it's not ethical this is literally ridiculous you know what i'm done i'm literally leaving sit down i'm done i'm the one leaving stop making that stupid face i'm done goodbye are you ready to go now no we're about to check out and she hasn't gotten ready yet. I literally told you that checkout is at 10 o'clock. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I thought you meant 10 p.m. She starts doing the who the hell checks out that early in the morning. You didn't specify a.m. or p.m. People sleep at 10 p.m. Why would they check out at 10 p.m.? 
So this is my fault now? My flight's in one hour, my hair and makeup artists are at the studio, and I'm gonna have to rebook everything because of you. Now I gotta make a phone call to reschedule the shoot. If you calmly asked, then I'd be ready by now. Okay, you please get ready and get out of your pajamas? Thank you. Well, you're not professional and you're not ethical. It's not professional and it's not ethical. You know what? We've been sitting here complaining too long. Come on, let's go. I'm done. I'm leaving. All you do is complain, complain. If you didn't complain, we would have left here hours ago. I'm done. I'm leaving. Whatever. Go find your own way home. What is this? A cola. I asked for a diet cola. And she gives me a regular cola. I asked for a diet cola. Oh, that's the same thing. No, it's not. Yeah. 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 Apparently, she wanted the diet one. It's all the same thing. Sick and tired of your bullshit. They're the same thing. It's both cola. She starts walking into the window. Where are you going? Maybe you should go get your own stuff for a change. This is not about the cola. It's about being a responsible sister. She brings up my irresponsibility, which I don't believe I am. It's not professional and it's not ethical. She is a stay-at-home mom and she can't even do regular tasks. I'm done. I'm leaving. Go leave like you always do, running away from your problems. Should I buy mom this new Birkin? Go ahead. You're literally a millionaire. She decides to call me a millionaire, knowing damn well I'm a billionaire. You seriously did not just call me a millionaire right now. There are millions in billions. Did you not go to school or something? I literally go to law school. I'm here doing more work than all of you guys have done combined, and you're gonna sit here and mistake me as a millionaire. Wow. You asked about a bag, I called you a millionaire, and what about it? I did not make 18 brands for you to sit here and call me a millionaire. whoop de f***ing You have 18 brands, no one cares. You know what, give me your phone. What are you doing? Oh my god, what was that for? You're a millionaire, buy another one, I'm out of here. You ate a slice of my bread. Um, I did. I'm about to eat a slice of bread, and then I noticed one is missing. It's literally just bread. Why can't I have one? You never buy your own sh so it's frustrating when I see that some of my stuff are missing. Well, what do you want me to do? Poop it out and give it back to you? Then she starts making sarcastic jokes. Now I gotta go back to the store, buy another loaf of bread, and then we're gonna be late to our business shoot. Then reschedule the shoot. It's my holiday Christmas fragrance collection, and you're gonna be in it. She always wants me to be in these photo shoots that I never signed up for. That's fine, take me out of the shoot. I'll spend time with my kids anyway. It's about the memories in life. Oh my God, you're such a lazy person. I can't believe you right now. You call me a lazy person. I don't get why she's the victim. You know what? At the end of the day, it's not about how much money we have in our bank account. It's about the memories we make. And I'm trying to load a Snapchat, but your Wi-Fi is working. Then get the out. Get oh my gosh. You know what? I'm sick of this. You're always calling me lazy, and I didn't want to be in the shoot anyway. Also, your butt is so big, it covers half of the set. And you know what? I'm done. I'm leaving. Christmas decoration at me, and then it makes me fall. You seriously did not just throw a decoration at me right now. You know I have asthma. I can't do this athletic stuff. Why are you changing your color? Because that's where my heart is. She starts getting mad at me because she doesn't know biology. That's not where your heart is. Well, when we were five, you told me that's where the heart is. Are you accusing me of lying? accuses me of lying. It's not professional and it's not ethical. How is any of this my fault? There you go. Victimizing yourself once again. I'm done. I'm leaving. Oh, and by the way, this Christmas tree looks hideous. Who makes this white and pink together? Whatever. Just go home. Get out okay. of here. Bye. I'm done. <laughs> oh my god. Stop. Whatever. Do this sh yourself. I'm done.
Is that a voice effect or your real voice? Well, no, it is not a voice effect. But when I want to talk higher, my voice can just naturally reach this tone. Yeah. So many people have been asking me to try Shake Shack here in LA and when I first heard of Shake Shack, I thought it was a shack where you shake your booty. But I was wrong. Apparently, it's an amazing restaurant with burgers, fries and shakes. So we're going to try some of them. So the things that I got was this chicken sandwich, an Oreo shake and a bacon and cheese loaded fries. So first up was this chicken sandwich and you guys, it was so juicy, tender, crispy and crunchy. This was such a good first bite and now it makes me want to go back and try their beef burgers. And now it's time for this Oreo thick shake, which has this chocolate mousse on top of it. And oh my God. I can't explain it, but it literally tastes like a melted Oreo McFlurry. This is so thick and delicious. 10 out of 10. And the last thing we have here is our bacon and cheese loaded fries. And I really pulled this out thinking it was a fork. But anyway, the fries themselves are so yummy. I love crinkle cut fries. So this was just amazing. The cheese and bacon also really added to it, but I wish they used real stringy cheese rather than the cheese sauce. But overall, I really love the food here. So if you ever go past it, go check it out. Do you like my new book? No. I'm literally so offended right now. I need to find a new sister. Do you seriously think that looks good? Yeah. 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 How are the paparazzi gonna fit that butt in the whole picture? How much did that even cost? $400,000. Or $100,000. She doesn't even spend that much money on her kid. The money I spend is none of your business. Look, you can't even sit down properly. Then she starts making unnecessary comments. It's not professional and it's not ethical. What's wrong with my butt? It's so embarrassing. I don't want to be seen with you in public with your butt looking like that. Wow, you are not a supportive sister. Oh, so I'm not the supportive sister. Every time you ask me about my opinion, I tell you the truth and nothing but the truth. our homework or else you're cut suck your butt you butt sucking butt suck suck <laughs> you're a stinky butt you're a stinky butt butt yeah hey look it's a loser geek loser get out of our way <laughs> Can you do a Siri voice, please? Okay. <clears throat> Hello, my name is Siri, your virtual assistant. I'm sorry, I'm not sure I understand. Are you guys twins? Well, we sound the same, so... Yeah. 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 Literally. Literally. And we look the same. We both have very round faces. Who didn't take out the trash? It was me. I'm so disgusted right now. She had one job to do and she can't even do it. Oops, I forgot. I told you, it's garbage day tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Well, don't we have garbage men to do that for us? She always expects the workers to do it. Why can't she do it herself for once? I don't get paid enough to care. You know I do things all the time. Like what? I'm a stay-at-home mom. Her kid is literally 18 years old. I retire. What do you mean you retire? Which means I'm sick of your shit. Why are you mad at me? You put me in such an uncomfortable situation and you know I'm not happy. You know I'm crying. Why would you do that? And then she starts crying like she always does. It's not professional and it's not ethical. I'm sorry, but crying is not going to solve the problem. You taking out the trash will. You know what? You're always disregarding my feelings. You never think about what I do in my life. You don't think that I'm a busy person? Oh, I'll take it out myself. I'm done. I'm leaving. I'm gonna go through a McDonald's drive-thru in my Kardashian voice. Can I please get a large double McChicken meal? <laughs> um, yeah. No ring to settle today? Yeah. Thank you. Mm. 
literally so obsessed. make a phone call to reschedule the shoot. If you call me ask, then I'd be ready by now. Okay, could you please get ready and get out of your pajamas? Thank you. Well, you're not professional and you're not ethical. It's not professional and it's not ethical. You know what? We've been sitting here complaining too long. Come on, let's go. I'm done. I'm leaving. You do complain, complain. If you didn't complain, we would have left here hours ago. I'm done. I'm leaving. Whatever. Go find your own way home. Guess the country, go. Cowrie shoe. Shoes! What? <laughs> Camera blow on. What? <laughs> ka <-ching. laughs> Me, ice cow. Me, ice cow. <laughs> the chicken question mark. The box! <laughs> I don't know. Then, I can't guess any of these, they're so hard. Gorilla O. Gorilla O. Oh. <laughs> up gun egg muscle. <laughs> what? Up gun egg. Up. Ireland. Ireland. <laughs> Nigeria. J one ten. Japan. You guys, I'm gonna see which content creator can do the the best. Me. Yes, how can I help you? Can I please have the book up up um there? Yep, sure thing. Just come along. Sorry, I can't reach it. Was there anything else I could grab you? Um no, that's okay. No, that's all good. Okay, okay bye. Bye. Wow, look at all the free stuff. Come on, help me grab it. What's this? Okay, onto the bathroom. Um, what are you doing? I'm grabbing the free soap. Come on, grab a bottle. Help me out. Um, the hair dryer is not free. Yes, it's free. I paid for the hotel. Anything under here? What do you want? Hi, so we received a noise complaint from next door that you're being too loud. No, that wasn't me. But you're the only one that- No, it wasn't me. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Guess the country, go. Is that apples? Jam. Jamaica. Oh. Lamb meatloaf butt. Lamb meatloaf butt meat. Bob, what? Frogman? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Frogman? This game doesn't even make sense. Romania. I am professional and ethical. Bull Ivy. Bolivia. You got that. Uganda. Uganda! I re plane. Ireland! What? <laughs> I five? High five? It's a what? <laughs> Brow and I. Brow and I. <laughs> Music P Rose. Po, po. Royal Magic Bell. up! Ten sleep near. 
<laughs> Since when was Nya a word? You guys, Nya has always been a word. We just put it on the back of a hoodie. Nya. 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 Stop copying me. It's not for not what? Professional and ethical? Nya. 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 Literally. 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 Shop literally by Angelo, link in biology. It's not biology, you dumb bitch. Hi, excuse me, do you sell gift cards? No. Hi, my name is Agatha, I'm 53 years young, I'm from Mississippi, and I'm an extreme cheapskate. Air conditioning can be so expensive nowadays, so what I do to save money is I just grab a popsicle stick, and then I wave it around, and now I got a homemade air conditioner. By using a popsicle as an air conditioner, Agatha saves $2 a year on the electricity bill. And I usually save it for later by ripping up a piece, and now I got two air conditioners. Another way I save money is with my chewing gum. So after I finish my gum, normal people just throw it in the trash, <laughs> but not in my household. So I actually keep a whole pack in my refrigerator. So every time I'm finished, I just put it in the container and I can save it for later. The average American purchases 20 packs of gum every year, but Agatha has purchased one in the entire decade. Everyone tries to bully me for my cheapness, but at the end of the day, I'm the one saving money, not them. What are you doing? Close the door. The AC is off. Name a character in three seconds. Go. Happy. Happy. Happy, Happy what? From Spider-Man. Oh. <laughs> uh, Harry Styles. <laughs> Carmen. <laughs> Carmen. Eric Carmen. Oh. L. L. <laughs> uh. I was thinking of the elephant Dumbo. Rachel Berry from Glee. <laughs> Just a city boy! And born and raised in South Petra! Zendaya in. <laughs> Gia, Gia from Brooklyn Nine Nine. Uh, Octonauts from Octonauts! <laughs> what? That's a character! Octonauts is a character. <laughs> so cold. Um, yes. Greg Rexon from Masama High Time, Mr. G. Don't <laughs> <No, I can't. laughs> train engine. <laughs> Bet Barbie. Russell from Up. What? I got you a snack. Mm, yummy. Um, where did my money go? I don't know. I was in the kitchen for two seconds, and when I came back, my money's missing. You took my money. No, I did not. Yeah. 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 I didn't take her money. I don't know what she's talking about. I'm gonna check the security system. Then go check it. I don't care. Fine. I am gonna go check it. I go to check the security system to see if she's cheating. And of course, she's cheating. It's not professional and it's not ethical. Well, this is awkward. I checked the security system. It was you. I took it because I want to win something for once. How is that my problem? Stop being a bitch. I swear. What are you doing? Ow! She starts hitting me with her handbag. I literally cannot do this right now. What started off as a game is now this big argument. I can't deal with it. What's wrong with cheating? I just wanted to win once. And now you're trying to hit me with your handbag? I'm sick of this oh. You know what? I'm done. I'm leaving. Clean up that yourself. Can you please stop doing the... Is not funny. Nobody's forcing you to laugh and it's just a fun face to do. If you're having a bad day and you don't agree with someone, you could just... Or if the teacher gives you a lot of homework, you could just... Go try it out because this face is literally good for everyday use. Yeah. Who took my phone charger? I did. I was going to charge my phone and then I noticed my charger's missing. I told you not to touch my thing. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what percentage are you on? 
Now she's asking what percentage I'm on when it's my charger. It's not professional and it's not ethical. It's just a charger. She can buy a billion more. It's not about the percentage. It's about being a respectful sister. I need the charger. I'm working from home. It's working from home? Now she's claiming I'm twerking from home. Working from home, not twerking from home. Twerking, twerking, it's the same thing. You need to learn how to listen properly because you're irritating me. Why are you calling me irritating? All I wanted to do was borrow your charger and now you're making a big deal out of it. You know what, I'm done, I'm leaving. Name the animal in three seconds, go. Queen. <laughs> Monkey. Land animals. Land, <laughs> land animals. Um. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, what were you gonna say? <laughs> um, Ferrari. Ah. Is that wrong? Oh, I found the goal. Um, cow. Snake. Uh, boring. Um, alligator, alligator, alligator. Jack. <laughs> um, broccoli. Took my hair out. It was hurting. Okay, go. No animal that's such a thing. Um, you. Everyone keeps tagging me saying I look like this cat. You guys, I don't even look like. Actually, you know what? Maybe everyone's right. Yeah. I change my song two times a day. If my agro falls in this pussy all day. Bomba. Running out my vagina. Running out my vagina. Criminal offense. Side eye. Cat is a virgin, but don't get nervous. I'm here to serve you customer service. I say, but you live to be your. I say, but you live to be your. Since you guys are literally so obsessed with it, I'm gonna show you a tutorial. So first you gotta turn your head and add a little bounce, yeah. And then you wanna make your eyes as big as you can. And then lastly, add the tongue, add the zoom in, and add the sound effect. Guess the country, go. Box, kiss, arm. What the hell? Um, moon, goal, Mongolia. Equals door, equals pasta, echo. <laughs> uh, look, I got wet too. Um, panna breastfeed, panna breastfeed. Panama. Oh! <laughs> look at how flat my hair is. <laughs> Bell. Muscle man, muscle mania. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, the filter wasn't working, so we're playing a new game. Sing the song with the word. Give. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? <laughs> because tonight will be the night that I will fall for you. <laughs> we found love in a hole. We found love in a hole. <laughs> <laughs> the balloon. Set never say never. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Easy round. Easy round. All I ask is if this is my ow. Don't show up. Don't stand <laughs> Hi, my name is Jody. I'm 39 years of age. I'm from Sydney, Australia, and I love drinking boost juice. Everywhere I go, I always have a boost juice with me. When I'm walking my dog, when I'm doing Pilates, when I'm in a business meeting, or when I'm cleaning the house, you name it, I'll always have one in my hand. Jody drinks boost so often that she's become a VIP at her local boost store. Watermelon crush for Jody. Enjoy your day. I'm actually part of the Vibe Rewards program, so every time I buy a boost, I earn a point. But at the moment, they're offering double points, which means I can get my free boost quicker. Being part of the Vibe Rewards program has helped Jodie find her meaning in life. 
people always say to me, Jody, why do you always drink boost? Or Jody, why do your bangs look uneven? Honestly, I don't think they realize how much of a lifestyle this is. Ah, can I speak to the manager? Who made this? But this is so delicious. I love it. Keep up the good work. Where are you going? Taking a shower. I was going to shower first. And now she wants to shower. I said I was going to shower first. You said that two hours ago. Yeah. 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 I'm just taking a shower. I don't know why it's a big deal. You have 19 showers. Go use another one. She said I have 19 bathrooms when I actually have 32. Well, if you do have 32, then why can't I use another shower then? It's not about the number of showers. It's about the environment. I don't want us showering at the same time. Then she starts talking about the environment. There are bigger problems in life. Like, look at your sock. There's a hole in it. I can't believe she's making fun of my sock. It's not professional and it's not ethical. Why are you making fun of my sock? I'm not making fun. I'm just saying you're focusing on the wrong thing. Why? Just because I said that you can't shower. You are so inconsiderate. Every time you come to my house, I let you use my showers. Why won't you let me use yours? Just one. You know what? I'm done. I'm leaving. Give me your hat, ass hat. <laughs> what you looking at? What the hell you looking at? What you looking out? What the hell you looking at? What you looking out? What the hell you looking at? What are you doing, you poop biscuit? <laughs> that was good. Yeah, it was. <laughs> You're going to the dance looking like that? Ew. Burn. Hey, loser. Yeah, loser. Are you eating lunch? Eating lunch. How about eat this bitch? Get out of our way, loser. Give me your books. What are you, some sort of freak? Yeah, a book. <laughs> W-E-I-R-D-O, you're a weirdo. Hey, hey, you're a weirdo. Break it down now. You guys, why would we be faking it? It's literally real. Why would we ever have to fake anything like if that? If we had to fake it, then it's not professional and it's not ethical. It's literally so real. Literally. Literally. So don't forget to watch this episode because the drama is literally intense. Yeah. 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 Hi, my name is Barbara. I'm 39 years of age. I'm from Louisiana and I'm addicted to aid and toilet paper. So it started out as a hobby in 2009 and ever since then I've been eating it every day. Barbara eats 20 rolls of toilet paper a day. That's 7,000 in a year. So while other people buy square cheese, I just use toilet paper. So usually I put this in my sandwich when I'm feeling hungry or I'm feeling a little bit peckish. I put it into a piece of bread and there you go, that's my meal. The COVID-19 pandemic was absolutely wild. Everyone was panic buying toilet paper so I did whatever I could to bring some home. During the pandemic, Barbara bought 400 toilet paper rolls a day. That's enough to cover the state of Ohio. Only close family members know about this because I get it, it could be hard to understand, but I like to keep it that way. Can I have some toilet? No! Go buy your own. This is mine. Name a food in three seconds. Go. Elephants. <laughs> um, eggs. <laughs> uh, dingleberry. What? Is that it? It's a fruit. Tennis bowl. <laughs> Tennis bowl cake. What? <laughs> Wednesday Adams. <laughs> Fruit salad. Yummy, yummy. Milk. <laughs> oh. Um, Thomas the Tank Engine truck. <laughs> <laughs> snakes. Do people eat snakes? Yeah. Whales. People eat whales. <laughs> Carrot to the K. <laughs> Carrot to the K. Ew, this is so cringe. Guilty. Bananas. Easy. <laughs> Carrots! Finally! You can do. Guana. Don't, don't. Eat. Water. Oh, easy. All oranges. Oh, okay, I'll take that. Well, that is a food. <laughs> Vagina! 
We're starting a new food series called Is It Professional and Ethical? Where we try new foods and see if they're professional and ethical. Today we have these Lotus Biscoff ice cream bars and everyone on TikTok is going crazy over them. They were sold out everywhere, but luckily we got our hands on them. So far it looks professional and ethical. And let's give it a try. Mmm. Mmm. I literally so obsessed. Literally. Yeah. There's a layer of biscoff. The outer layer is white chocolate. And then there's more biscoff cookies on the edge. If you don't know what biscoff is, it's pretty much a caramelized cookie that tastes really good. But you guys, it was $7.50 for three. That's not ethical. It is professional. It's, yummy. it's professional, but it's not ethical. On the professional and ethical scale, how would you rate it? 8 out of 10. I would say 10 out of 10, but because you only get three box, six out of 10, but it's still a good ice cream. <laughs> no matter how sick we are, we're always working. You, you don't do stuff. You know what? You act like I don't do shit. You have like this narrative in your mind. I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is that you never no, 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 do no, any I will work. literally f you up if you mention that shit again. You, stop laughing like that. You look like a freak. I just, I... I don't want to hear about this narrative that she's the only one with work ethic and that she's doing this and this and this. It's just, it's such bullshit. We don't have to do things the same way. And you know what? If I didn't want to work my ass off and I wanted to be a stay-at-home mom, then that's literally Ow, what the is wrong with you? Get out of here. Guys, what is going on here? How old are How you? Old am I? You two ladies, stop. Stop, ladies. One minute they're laughing, and then the next minute they're laughing each other. Like, this is crazy. So I can't believe it's gotten this far. Like, you just, you don't treat your sister like that. Why would you slap her like that? She did it to me. Well, you both did it. So don't only come to me. Why was your reaction violent? Are you crazy? I'm not about violence, and I don't want to go there, but I'm not just going to let her attack me and think that she can get away with it. It's not professional, and it's not ethical. She's a problem, and she should leave. That's in your head, too. You literally... Well, everyone thinks it. Everyone who? Literally everyone. Me, mom... I Never be around you guys. There's no need. Then get the out. Get out. Whatever. I'm done. I'm leaving. I'm sick of it. Pollution. No way. It is the 31st century. We have no oxygen. We cannot breathe. Pause. This is a picture of a sea animal. If we continue dumping plastic in the ocean, this is unacceptable. It's such a nice day today. I'm gonna do the right thing and chuck this in the bin. This is acceptable. Stopping pollution is the best solution. Guess the character, go. I'm the guy from South Park. What's his name? I don't know any of their What? Tinkerbell. <laughs> Tinkerbell. Yes. The green. Yep, correct. The Homer Simpson. <laughs> Shrek. I don't <laughs> Nemo or Marlon? <laughs> yep. Um, El Elmo. What is that? Yeah. Why did Mickey Mouse? Ah, uh, easy. The girl from Minecraft. <laughs> Papa Smurf. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say Grandpa Smurf. But... Mario done. What? Stewie! Oh my God! Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hello, Brian. Um, <laughs> um Jackson Gray. <laughs> Who is Jackson Gray? Um, Daffy Duck. Ronald Duck. Ronald Duck. <laughs> <laughs> Ronald. Drink driving. Unacceptable. It can be scary. It can be dangerous. And it's very You guys. 
Karen saves five cents a day on cleaning products. That's seven hundred percent above the average American. Even when people come to my house, they gotta follow the rules. My house, my rules. Don't you see? You do. Then the celebrity go. Um, the funny guy. Facebook. 